Okay guys, what's good? How you doing? I hope you are doing well. Welcome to Vinel TV. If you are new to this channel and if you are, please consider subscribing. I will appreciate it. Thank you very much indeed for stopping by. Thank you very much indeed for clicking. I want to show you what we got here. We got this gear. This is Epson Expression Home XP3155. XP3155. This printer is multifunctional printer. It's multitask triple and one if you like in the sense you can copy scan and print from this gear check my video how we unbox this printer we loaded the paper tray installed the ink cartridges complete that adjustment so check the series of video how we proceed what i want to show you with this printer is how to connect this printer to wi-fi network this printer is dual band you can connect it via Wi-Fi network and USB cable connection. Unfortunately, USB cable is not included in the packaging. We have this Advenet Tech Store free delivery here in UK. I'm going to show you this, the USB cable, what it looks like. Canon can use it. Epson can use it. HP can use it. USB is universal. Brothers can use it. With this printer right now, so check it out, Advenet Tech Store. This printer, I'm going to turn it around. This is the power cable goes in here and the, the USB cable goes to the side right here. Okay, it goes in here. Once you stick it one end inside, okay, so stick this end inside and this flat end goes to the back of your PC. Okay, so this end goes to the inside and this to the back of your PC. And if you have any paper jam, this is where to check for any paper jam and debris. So. So check for any paper jam and debris right here, okay? And gently remove it, okay? And put, make sure you put back the cover, okay? So right now this is A4 paper is what we have here. So turn this print around. Okay, here is the scanner, flat desk scanner. If you leave this printer up, the ink cartridge is right here in the corner. For you to change it once it's ready it will come right in the middle for you to change the ink it's using 603 ink or 603 extra large if you want to close this printer gently push this front and close okay right now this printer is pretty much ready the only thing we need to do is we need to connect this printer to wi-fi network okay and once you print if you print the document it will come right in, right here to stay with this printer right now, I can see a copy. So you can use the front panel or LCD screen to adjust to the particular area function you want to do. Okay, so you can adjust to the particular function you want to do or what you want to do. So use the OK button. Use the side to go to, this is scan. If you want to scan, press OK to scan. If you want to connect printer to Wi-Fi setup, then select the Wi-Fi and press OK. Okay. So right now, but what I want us to do is for us to connect this printer to Wi-Fi network using our mobile device. Okay. So we can connect this printer right now. What we need to do is first of all, I want to show you the process we need to do to connect this printer to Wi-Fi network. So to go to your P, your lab, your mobile device. Okay. Go to what we need to do is go to the Play Store on your mobile device. This is the Play Store. Type Epson Smart Panel. Epson Smart Panel. Click on it. Download it on your mobile device. Okay, so download it. It's already downloaded on my phone. Click Enable. So once you download it, click it open. So make sure it's downloaded on your mobile device. Click it open. Okay, and right now it's opening up. Okay. So right now it's searching for product. So right now what it's doing right now is searching for product. And make sure your printer is switched on. Okay. Right now I can see search 
for product with Wi-Fi. The product, the product power is on. Your smartphone is connected. It will tell you the Wi-Fi network, okay? If the Wi-Fi environment has been discharged, okay? Then it's... You can also go back, okay? Now, what, what I want us to do is, okay? Right now is go to... What would you like to do? Would you like to check if your product is supported with Wi-Fi network? Select no. Now, set up a new product, okay? So what we need to do, set up a new product. Okay, select set up a new product on the panel. Now, I will tell you, thank you for choosing your Epson product. Thank you for choosing your Epson product. Let's start it. Click continue. Turn on Bluetooth in your smartphone. Click turn on. So right now, Bluetooth is turning on, okay? Make sure your product is turned on. If a USB cable is connected to the product, disconnect it and turn the product off and on again. Select next. So right now it's searching. Okay, you can see it found the product. Select the product to connect. You can see XP3150. This printer is XP3155, but it starts from the range XP3150 series. Select again, select on it. Are you sure you want to select XP3150? Select yes. Okay, do you want do you want to set up Wi-Fi on this product? Go back and check again. Select yes. Okay, I can see yes. Confirm the product status. Check the product to your wireless network. Do you want use the network shown below? It will show you your Wi-Fi network. Select yes. Okay, Wi-Fi network password is required. Click yes. Next. The password is usually shown on the back or side of the router or in the router document. Click next. Okay. It may be called an encryption key or key or security key. Select next. Did you confirm the password? Select yes. Okay. Some characters are similar in shape. So make sure you enter the correct one. You must use the correct character or you will not be able to connect to Wi-Fi. Example, the number 6 and the lower key B and the letter I and lower key. So make sure you select the correct number. Click next. Okay. So right now we need to put the password for the details. Okay. I have the information here. So I have the information for the Wi-Fi. So what I'm going to do right now is move away and put the information required. Then we'll come back okay and you need to make sure the information you put if it's uppercase make sure it's uppercase if it's lowercase make sure it's lowercase you can also select the eye sign on, on on your mobile device for you to be able to see the figure or the input the, the details you are putting to make sure it's correct Okay, so once you are happy with it, just press the I sign by the side for you to see what you put. And if you finish, once you finish, okay, press select OK. Okay, and right now, do you want to connect printer to Wi-Fi network? Yes, select yes. Right now, okay, it's preparing the setting. Wait, the product Wi-Fi setting is complete. So wait until the product Wi-Fi. can see how one percent actually is connected already because i can see it on the on the printer that is already connected but you need to wait until this is complete seven percent eight percent wait until the product wifi setting is complete so once it's complete we are now able to print documents and do a lot of stuff but we need to wait you can see 20 percent
Okay, forty percent is going, it's progressing slow and steady. You can see hundred percent. Okay. Wi-Fi is set up is complete. The, the smartphone and the product is connected. So once you see this information, you can see it, it show us a good can this is the printer, this is the Wi-Fi, and it's showing us right now. Click next. Here we go. You can see ready print. Okay, so this is how to connect this printer right now. And the next thing you can do is just just need to okay you can register your printer okay to for you to ready print okay subscribe from one pound 29 euro pan or 129 199 euro a month and never run out of ink if you select a middle now you register your printer for ready print okay but right now i like to use this as pay as you go so it's not what i want to do okay with right now you can see ready print you just need to go to particular okay so select anything you want to do if you want to scan select scan right now you can scan this is for you to scan okay if you want to copy select copy for you to copy okay so anything you want just need to document capture select document capture document print okay so right now this is document print photo okay so you just need to select anything you want right now from this printer any function you want okay so this is how to connect this printer to wi-fi network okay if you're happy with this tutorial please do consider to subscribe it helps the channel thank you very much indeed and stay blessed i'm going to show you on my next video how to scan document with this printer thank you and stay blessed i appreciate you thank you